Today's devotion from Charles Spurgeon is entitled, Pray That They Be With Christ. Our scripture for today comes from John chapter 17, verse 24. Father, I will that they also, whom thou hast given me, be with me where I am, that they may behold my glory, which thou hast given me, for thou lovest me before the foundation of the world. O oh, death, why do you touch the tree beneath whose spreading branches weariness has rest? Why do you snatch away the excellent of the earth, in whom is all our delight? If you must use your axe, use it upon the trees that yield no fruit. You might then be thanked. But why do you fell the goodly cedars of Lebanon? O oh, stay your axe and spare the righteous. But no, it must not be. Death smites the goodliest of our friends, the most generous, the most prayerful, the most holy, the most devoted, must die. And why? It is through Jesus' prevailing prayer. Father, I will that they also, whom thou hast given me, be with me where I am. It is that which bears them on eagles' wings to heaven. Every time a believer mounts from this earth to paradise, it is an answer to Christ's prayer. A good old divine remarks, Many times Jesus and his people pull against one another in prayer. You bend your knee in prayer and say, Father, I ask that your saints be with me where I am. Christ says, Father, I will that they also, whom thou hast given me, be with me where I am. Thus the disciple is at cross purposes with his Lord. The soul cannot be in both places. The beloved one cannot be with Christ and with you too. Now which pleader shall win the day? If you had your choice, if the king should step from his throne and say, here are two supplicants praying in opposition to one another, which shall be answered? Oh, I'm sure, though it were in agony, you would start from your feet and say, Jesus, not my will, but yours be done. You would give up your prayer for your loved one's life if you could realize the thoughts that Christ is praying in the opposite direction. Father, I will that they also whom thou hast given me be with me where I am. Lord, you shall have them. By faith, we let them go.